Whether you are a brand new or a long-term user, these apps will change or improve the way you use your Mac. Let's go with the video. Number one is OnlySwitch. OnlySwitch provides a series of toggle switches to simplify your routine work, such as hidden icons, dark mode, and some other options. These switches shows on your status bar, and you can control them super easy. We go to the menu bar over here, and you can see all the options that we have available. For example, I have high desktop icons. As you can see, if we toggle, everything disappears on my desktop. Then we have a dark mode. We can also change it. We have the keep away, screen savers, and some other options. Now, if we go to the settings, you can go to customize and in customize, you see all the other options that you have to add or remove from your menu bar on top. You have the option to hide the notch if you're in a different Mac. You have the mute, you have the auto hide dock, Bluetooth, show hidden files, radio player, which is really nice. I don't know who actually listens to radio nowadays, but it's super cool. Uh, you can empty your clipboard, uh, show extension names, and you have some other options that I will have to try them and see how they go. Number two is Pasty. Pasty is a clipboard manager that makes it easy to access and organize your clipboard history. It's a great tool for anyone who copies and pastes a lot of text, images, or other data between different apps. Here are some of the cool things that you can do with Pasty. Quickly find copied items using advanced search that lets you search by content, source application, and type of content such as images, reach, and plain text. As you can see here, uh, I have copied a couple of stuff from different uh, applications like the Notes, um, uh, Google Chrome, Safari, and so far so on. So they pretty much set everything over here for you. Now, if you want to, for example, use this part over here, you can just drag it to your desktop and then we can find it here as a note. You have all the text right over here. You can also exclude certain apps from being tracked by the clipboard manager. Easily find items in your clipboard history by viewing large clear previews of the copied content. Endless clipboard storage options. Keep track of your copied items for as long as you want, whether it's just for a day, a week, or even forever. Number three is Xsnip. Xsnip has some really cool image annotation tools that are super easy to use, such as a scrolling capture. This feature lets you capture a full page screenshot even if the content isn't showing on the current screen. You can use it to capture your source code, article, chat history, or anything else you need. Next is Windows Capturing. With the shadow effect, you can capture multiple windows at once. It's like having a virtual screenshot team. Also, we have the Color Picker tool. Pick the color of any pixel on the screen and make it pixel perfect captures. It's like having a magic paintbrush for your screen. Physical unit. Measure objects on the screen with the physical unit size indicator of selection. It's like having a ruler for your digital world. Pin images. Pin a screenshot over any images on your screen. It's like having a virtual sticky note for your screen. One of my favorite and number four is Dropover. Dropover is a handy tool that makes drag and drop a breeze. It lets you stash, gather, or move any draggable content without opening multiple windows. It's like having a secret storage shelf for your Mac that pops up when you need it and it floats over the windows. This way, you can navigate stress-free to your destination. Just shake your cursor and drop whatever you're dragging onto the shelf that appears nearby. Then, you can move all the items at once when you are ready. On number 5, it's better display. 
Better Display is an amazing tool that it lets you turn your displays into a fully scalable screens, adjust the brightness, and even boost the brightness beyond 100% on compatible displays. You can also dim the display all the way to black and create virtual display dummies for your Mac. Plus, you can make picture-in-picture -picture windows of your display and access a bunch of other features to easily manage your display settings from the menu bar. Here are some of the cool features. Smoothly scale displays on Apple Silicon even without mirroring a dummy display. Change the display settings using software and hardware control via sliders and native or custom keyword shortcuts. You can also create custom resolution. Manually create custom resolutions for real displays and redefine certain system displays parameters. Number six is Hand Mirror. It's a super simple app that lives in your menu bar and gives you one click access camera check. Need to jump on a video call? Quick camera check. Need a view of your camera for when you are streaming or recording your screen? Quick camera check. And drag the windows around. Need a view of your camera for when you're streaming or recording your screen? Quick camera check. To check your face because you're pretty? Quick camera check. On the spot, number seven is Parcel. If you're looking for an app to track deliveries on Mac, iPhone, iPad, or Apple Watch, Parcel is the best choice for you. With this app, you can quickly access tracking information from 300 delivery services, including UPS, USPS, FedEx, DHL, Tnet, PostChina, Amazon Logistics, and many others. Now, let's talk about Parcel's push notifications. They are way more convenient than any other app. They pop up on your Mac and iOS devices at the same time. Plus, you can easily find your delivery on the map or manage your delivery using web access. Super nice. On the number eight is ICE. If the top bar is getting too crowded, here's a handy app called ICE. It hides all your icons on the top bar and lets you display them all easily with a simple click. You can also drag and drop interface to arrange menu bar items. Customize the menu bar's appearance, menu bar, menu bar item search, and the custom menu bar item spacing. Number nine, it's Pixelmator Pro. Recently acquired by Apple, it's a powerful image editing tool that anyone can use. It's like having a professional image editing suite at your fingerprints. With a wide range of tools for editing and retouching photos, creating graphic design, painting, drawing, vector graphics, and adding stunning effects, Pixelmator Pro is the only image editor you will ever need. Customize the Pixelmator Pro workspace to make it work for you. Move the tools and layer sidebars wherever you want and completely customize the list of tools. Or choose one of the builds in presets created especially for photographers, designers, painters, and illustrators. To deliver a more intelligent image editing, Pixelmator Pro uses machine learning, a technology that allows computers to gain knowledge to perform a specific task more like a person than a computer, which enabled us to create futures that have never before been possible. Number 10 is Latest. Latest, it's a free and open source app for macOS that checks if all your apps are up to date. It gives you a quick overview of which apps change and what change, and it lets you update them right away. Latest currently supports apps downloaded from the Mac App Store and apps that use Sparkle for updates, which cover most of the apps on the market. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please subscribe, like, and comment down below with which are your favorite apps. That way, we can check them out and maybe make a video about them. Thanks a lot. See you next time. Bye-bye.